Welcome to Welcome BLE, BLE Club Cash. It's your girl Jasmine. It's your boy Rossi. And today it's just us two, no guests. All right, y'all. Today is Bay birthday. Yes. She I'm the a big. Dollar, she the big what? You been telling me that age? No. She the big eighteen. Yeah, I'm eighteen. <laughs> but before we get into anything, we need y'all to like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell. You know what I'm saying? Become part of the post notification game and spread the word about our podcast. Yes. Um, so So today I'm basically gonna ask Bay a couple of personal interview questions. Personal interview questions. You ready? Go ahead, ask me some questions. All right. What have you learned in life so far? Like valuable lessons? Um to be patient. Patience is virtue. Work on just being patient. Once you're patient, like you master it a lot. Cause if you're patient, then you can wait for stuff. If you're not patient, you got anxiety. You just all over the place. Being patient, like seriously, that's hard. Being patient. That's what I learned. That's it. I mean, being patient and and trying not to think negative. That's that's like what I learned. Mm-hmm. That's what I try and do every day. Like seriously, I have to have patience with the kids in the end. Just trying to be happy even if I don't feel happy because being down ain't going to do nothing. So, yeah. What do you love the most out of life? My kids and you. Yeah, yeah I love you. I love my kids too, though. You're supposed to. I know. But what if I didn't? They get on my nerves. I could say you. I could just say you. <laughs> you can't love me if you don't love my kids. I'm just playing. You know I love my kids. They get on my nerves, though. They get on both our nerves, but they are. Yeah. For life. Man, if y'all ain't got kids, y'all would never understand <laughs> the things that they put kids you through. Kids with an S. Like, if you got one, you probably don't even got that much. Mm, we be having three kids, and yeah. it's like a zoo. <laughs> it's like a zoo. It's like a zoo. You got one jumping off couches, hanging from the dang Two ceiling fan. Two jumping off couches. And you got another one that want to dash through the house like he's Flash or some shit. And then you got baby girl who just want to be in your face and you can't help but to spend all your time oh. on her. Mm-hmm. And you forget about other stuff you got to take care of. Like mm-hmm. It's just... So, what do you miss in the past? Is there anything in the past that you miss? Oh, yeah. Like what? I miss it not being COVID. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I really, like, miss is the world being regular. Like, this new world, new order, new new metaphors, new, all this new stuff. Metaphors. I sound like a old person saying I don't like the new stuff, but, like, I really don't. I mean, it's understandable. Because... Like, life is just not the same no more. It's not. Like, you can't just walk in the store normally. You can't no just more. go to uh, Cedar Point or, like, Chuck E. Cheese without feeling like you can't touch everything. Or just, like, right. anything. You can't even cough or sneeze when normally. When did I been to a restaurant? An 8 in? Yeah. <laughs> Almost, like, a year or two. Like, it's been a minute. Like, it's just weird. It's not cool. And it's, like... We got to be careful because we got a baby, so... So, I really be, like, in-house. Like, that whole snowstorm yesterday and stuff, I didn't step foot outside at all. Yeah, we had a... Cleveland had a big snowstorm the other day. I mean, everybody getting effect from that... Well, yeah, um, from that tornado. No, it was the volcano. Volcano. The volcano erupted in Tongay. I think that's it, right? And, um... Yeah, volcano erupted underwater, so then that's making tsunami waves and snowstorms. That's what's happening. Uh. Uh, yeah. There you have it. But they saw the volcano eruption from space. Like, you know, they could see it was like real big, a real big impact. But um, yeah, I had to go out in that crap and dig the car out of the dang parking spot. That shit took like an hour and what, an hour twenty thirty minutes. I've been watching a lot of people get their cars out the snow just looking out the window. Yeah. Like, damn. And it's just the parking lot? It's just the parking lot. Like, yeah, it was just the parking lot. We had buses. I'm used to winter storms. Out of commission on, on the side of the road and everything. Like, it was just crazy. I'm used to 
I always get a snowstorm on my birthday. I know, but this shit, and then this happened in less than 24 hours. But this is so typical January yeah. weather. Not like this. Yes, it is. Storm. Man, I remember one year with my birthday, we had like four or five storms before my birthday, and then I had a storm on my birthday. Like, storms was back to back to back. Crazy. Snowstorms. Mm. I wasn't here. So, are you mentally happy? Yes, I am. You're mentally happy? Yes. What do you do to stay positive? I ain't gonna say too much, but one of the things I do to stay happy is listen to music. When I clean up, I like to clean up and listen to music. I ain't gonna say everything. What kind of music do you listen to? Can we talk? I ain't say what song. I said what kind of music do you Jene listen Aiko to? Janae Aiko and um, any girl. I like listening to um, like you know Erica Badu and all that stuff. I do listen to Erica and India. I'm gonna try to say Erica Badu. That's my. That's what I listen to. You should have said that's my girl. No. Oh, cause you touching your heart and shit. That's, the that's where my name, name at. My name right there. So don't be touching my name talking about another one. I touch right here. All right. Be telling the truth. All right, next. Next. (laughs) Next. Next. Because one day he was like, man, Erica Badu got a fatty. Or y'all was saying, or (laughs) y'all was saying, she she got a badonka duck. Whatever word you and your uncle be using. What he be using? Mama got ass. So, what he be using that word when we, when he told me. Yeah. Do got Thumper on like, the time. Erica, I do got a thumper. Like, yeah, they don't understand. That's fine wine right there. So, do you enjoy being a mom? Yes. What do you enjoy about it? <clears throat> Excuse me. I enjoy that I am their, like, leader, you know? They have to listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm their leader. You have to listen to me. I'm their leader. <laughs> I'm their leader. Yeah. She sound like the government over us. Like, what the fuck going on? No, I enjoy, um, I enjoy, like, when I do my mommy stuff, like, keeping their hair done, keeping them washed in the tub, feeding them. Like, when I do that stuff, I feel good because, you know, I'm like, I take care of my. Excuse me. Sorry. What's wrong? I almost sneezed. Oh. Corona. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna say virus on me? So, um, what's the next question? Love your mommy duties. You love your mommy, your mom, motherly duties. Yeah. I don't like my motherly body I got after this. No, it ain't nothing wrong with her body. She be critiquing the shit out of herself. Anyways. When will you grow your locks back? In process. It's in process. Yeah. I want to get the insta locks. So, what's, what's that on your head? This is the cap. <laughs> cap is the real. Cap. <laughs> the cap is real. Shut up. <laughs> so, yeah, what does gonna... being a black woman mean to you? Being a black woman mean I gotta, like, you know, hold my ground. Like, I gotta, I don't know. Like, I feel like it's just a lot. I don't know. It's a lot being a black woman. Yeah, it really is. is. It really is. Well, I commend you for being a black woman. A you don't know how people talk to me. Yeah. People talk to me any type of way because I'm a black they woman. They used to talk to you any kind of People way. still do. When? Why? Well, like when I'm like, okay, say I go to like a store and being a black woman in the store, you get um, harassed thinking that you're going to steal something. Like it's just like being a black woman is a lot. That's being a black person. Period. Yeah. Being a black person. But like when I go on the girly stories and no men in there, being a black woman, like okay. Yeah. Alright. Alright. <sighs> but I I ain't like really describe being a black woman. I just feel empowered. When do you when do you get to relax? Or when do you feel like you're relaxed? So the time I relax is from two AM to five AM because that's just like the time. I know for sure they sleep in a deep sleep, and I did. Yeah, that's just the time I relax. That's the time I'm either sleep or I'm up. I don't get no sleep. 
Because when I wake up in the morning, I got shit to do. All during the day. I edit. Take care of mamas. Clean the house. It's like a repetitive. It's hard to get relaxed time when you got so much going on. Like, you got the kids. Then, on top of that. What's for dinner? What's for dinner? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Clean the house. Washing clothes. On top of me having to go to work, and then when I go to work, it's just all on her. And then when I come home, it's like that be literally the time that we get to relax a couple hours. But I be tired, but I still be needing that little comfort, relaxation, me and her time. So, yeah. Last night you came home, you was like this, and you was knocked out. <laughs> you was not. I was tired. Have you been through depression? Yes. And what caused it? What caused your depression? Um, losing our place for a couple months. I ain't never been that depressed because I was pregnant. If I wasn't pregnant, I wouldn't even been probably that fucking depressed. But I was just my hormones. I was still throwing up. Oh my god, it was depressing. I must put a number on you. It was depressing. Mamas did a number on her, y'all. She was throwing up through the whole pregnancy. Like, the beginning of the pregnancy, we couldn't even record. We couldn't do nothing. Like, Drive. Do I couldn't nothing. Go in the car like, with him. Literally could not do nothing. She had me panicking because she couldn't keep no food down. Like, she was going to the hospital back and forth almost every other day because she was dehydrated. Mm -hmm. And they had to keep. Giving her IVs and stuff like it was just wild. I'm moments. like, this just better be a girl. <laughs> I'm like, this better be a girl. Yeah. Do you live life in the fast lane or do you see yourself more so in the slower lane? I I feel like I live in a. Mm -mm, what you think? Because we living together. This is a question for you. I don't know, cause I feel like I don't know. I feel like okay, fast. Because we're not settling and stuff, you know, like our plans and shit is like kind of like. Yeah. So it's not like slow. So yeah, fast. Fast lane. Yeah, fast, fast lane. lane. Full speed ahead, no Full brakes. Speed, no fast, brakes. No brakes. Yep, every day. <laughs> no brakes. All right, y'all. So that concludes the questions for my beautiful chocolate queen over here. Yeah. So now we're gonna spill a bit of tea. Uh y'all excuse my voice is going in and out because I'll be having to yell at work. You be having to yell at work. Yeah, it's loud in there. So what you be doing? You be yelling mm -hmm. like uh hey, yo. We really do be saying that <laughs> like no cap. <laughs> if so, somebody on the other end you gotta get their attention, you just hey yo and everybody will look uh, uh, and just point to who you flag down who you talk to. Uh, I don't know. Did you listen to it? But the baby came out with a new song called Sneaky Link. Nope. Yeah, it sounded horrible. Everybody was bashing him on Twitter about Swear. it. Yeah, they said like it was making their ears. They be making some bangers. I happened? know. I don't know. They said they made their ears hurt. bleed. Huh? Bleed. Ears bleed. Talking about he could have kept that track. That was the worst track ever, and he be making bangers. So. I gotta go listen to you, that. You gotta go listen to Sneaky Link. I That's heard hard it. hard to believe. It, it's, it really don't sound like him. Probably. I don't know. It don't. The industry's so weird. It really don't. So, did you hear about the guy at uh, Cracker Barrel? At Cracker Barrel? Yeah. No. No. You all heard about the guy at Cracker Barrel? At Nino. Uh, <laughs> so, the him. Cracker Barrel ordered to pay... A man $9.4 million after serving him a glass of full, a glass full, they gave him a glass full of surface cleaner chemicals and he drunk it. What? Yeah, his esophagus was burning and he got internal damages. They tried to pay him like four or five million, but he went back and made them pay him $9.4 million. That's still ain't enough because it took my life. I need, I need royalties. I need half ownership of all company, like yeah, yeah, nine million ain't enough. 
Yeah, it was supposed to be ice water. He took a gulp of that. So they tried to kill him because how do you mistake water? Where Where is your water? Why is chemicals located next to your water if it was a mistake, first of yeah. all? Yeah. Second of all, what the f who mistakes chemicals for water? You either getting water out of a faucet or out of a freezer. Mm -hmm. Chemicals shouldn't be in neither one of those places. In no yeah. restaurant. So, uh, oh, they tried to... The, the court tried to get him four point three million in just thirty minutes, like super fast. They tried to just settle a deal, like we'll give you four point three million. Just to shut him up. Just to no. shut him up, yeah. No, man. I need twenty bands. I need twenty million. I mean, that's crazy. Twenty million out the door. But one thing deal. at the bottom is say this haven't occurred in eight years, so it happened before. Before. Was what was his ethnicity? I don't know. His name is uh, William. Cornanin, Cornanin, Cornanin. I don't know. Let me see. I don't know. You about to look about. him up? Yeah, I don't know. So a girl in Virginia uh, was charged with lighting another student's hair on fire during lunch. So. Like what made what what what, what did she do to her to make her want to set her hair on fire? I don't know, but that's the real ill. Like, don't don't be out here trying to harm people. You ain't gonna get nothing but karma. First of all. And second of all, ain't nothing that serious. It's just never that serious for you to be lighting somebody here on fire. Man. Four people was experimented on in jail. They gave them that uh, COVID-19 pill. Uh, four? That's all they telling you. I guarantee you way more. You think it was more? Yes. So, yeah, they, they experimenting on people in jail with the COVID-19 pill. Um, A couple was married for 81 years. They was told their marriage wouldn't last. And it lasted 81 years. Yeah. Boom! Bow in y'all motherfucking face. Whoever yeah. said that it wasn't gonna last. That's so cute though. Like, I feel like once you pass 50 years married, that is, that is a go. How long you think we're gonna be married? Ever. Forever? No, ever. What's ever? It ain't no four or nothing. It's just ever. Ever. EVA. EVA. Ain't no end. Alright, bet. Bet. I'm gonna count you on that. Count you on it too. I mean, you don't want it. It don't matter. <laughs> so, do you know about Keith Power and Ryan Destiny? They broke up. Good. Why you say good? I don't know. I'm just That's not good. They was like black. She love she goes. she was too cute for him. She was too cute for him. Yeah, she too chocolate for him. He not up to par. He look real good. I don't know what you're talking about. I just want to say that because you said she was cute. Yeah. I said for him. I said for her. No. You want to get him in your throat? I now said he was later. cute for her. Now or later. I said he was cute for her. Now or later. You don't even like light skin niggas, so. I don't. Put cap into yourself. He not like saying he brown skin. No, he's not. I'm brown skin. <laughs> I was just playing. Go on looking all serious. Yeah, I'm going to snatch your ass off. I mean, if you snatch your last off, you might snatch <gasps> You heard about NL. Damn. Go down. You know I hit you like that all the time. Anyways, NL Chopper was fighting. He got. NLE. NLE Chopper. Got knocked out. No, he did not get knocked out. I seen the video. You see how they approach him? Yeah, but. Oh, he just Man, stole look. on him. He didn't even hit him. For real, look. Boom, NLE. Missed. He considered that knocking him out. He missed. And then it looked like he ran. He did. Look. Boom. Hit him. And then he hit him. Miss. He ducked. Or he slipped. Either he slipped or he ducked. Either way. The nigga in the orange coat missed. That's crazy. He ain't do shit. To I knocked him out. This, that, and third. He don't even look like he knocked nobody up. Chris Brown had uh, YK Osiris and Lily Chopper looking crazy on the court. Huh? Yeah. They was hooping. Who? Chris Brown and uh in Elite Chopper YK so YK Osiris. Oh, he's funny. He is that, too funny. They better quit playing with Chris on that court. Why Tusi asked this question? He said, What's nastier eating butt or spitting in yeah, the mouth? Ass or spitting in somebody's mouth. Which one asked? Man, ain't nobody ever spitting in my mouth. Like that's trifling as fuck. Yeah, that's just that's just mm -hmm. like the whole. Where did that thing. even come from? Like, where did the whole spit in my mouth, baby? Uh, who does that? 
nasty. If you do I that, like nigga, you trifling. They got that from like. And if she do that, she trifling. Y'all both trifling together. That's what trifling she can do. Yeah. You just spitting in somebody's mouth. <sighs> Ain't nothing sexy or fucking exotic about that. Go smack it. It is to some people. No. Like some people no. like that. Like it turns no. on. Not me. No. I don't That's even disgusting. like the other part. That is disgusting. So, yeah, but Tussie asked that, and you think it's spinning in the mouth. I do, too. I do, too. You saw how Kanye West was uh not invited to the baby birthday party? Yeah. And you then, seen all them? I don't know if that's real or if that was mean. You think them real pictures and stuff? Of him hitting the piano with her? Yeah. Him yeah. Going and, did he just crash the whole party? Like I mean... It looked like he crashed that Travis party. Scott told him where the party was at. He did? Yeah. I would have told him in your daughter party over there. Send him the location. Daughter sent it to him too. I know. Kim was probably like, shook. Kim kick rocks. Hey. That's his Kim, child. Your and daughter he, over here. He... He moved right across the street from the house. I would have too. You're not about to just disappear with my kids. Yeah. Like, what they break up for anyway? Uh, that Trump stuff. What Trump stuff? Well, he was supporting Trump. Oh, yeah. She ain't, she ain't, all right. She ain't like that. Well, he was a dummy. I knew you shouldn't have been supporting Trump. <laughs> so. She left your black ass for a reason. <laughs> she still ain't had to keep his kids away from him, though. Yeah. That was kind of wrong. Not yeah. inviting him to his daughter's birthday party. Like, that was wrong in all forms. But, yeah. I guess that's all with the juicy tea, y'all. Like, I'm going to have some more next video. But it's my birthday. I'm not trying to do too much editing. I'm about to relax. Oh, yeah, money bags. Y'all got a new water coming out. You got the a water brand. Yeah, it's called the best water in the world. The in America. best water in America. Yeah, the best water in America. Mm, we should try it. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. I like water. We got to test the pH levels on there first. You don't test the pH levels for anything else. But I you watch, test what you mean? This water. So you mean tell me I wouldn't watch heavy videos you watched on the water it, but that they, I, You don't know if they did that in Michigan. And I did test it. Or if when in I was working at CPP, we had the pH. I brought the pH you water stuff You post a hat on deck every time you drink the water. I just drink the same drink. water. No, you don't. You capping. You don't drink the same water. What water I drink? You ain't never tested my spring water that I get from Jamie. You drink though. that. You drink it too. I just gave you a you cup this morning. You drink it more than me. Okay, because I drink by gallons. Obviously, you cool, so. Ain't no you said way. obviously I'm cool. So, something's supposed to be wrong with me. I guess you ain't dehydrated or you ain't having no bodily function <laughs> problem, so water must be cool. I love water, y'all. I drink core and essential. I'm trying to get him to drink more water. And eternal. Those are the waters I drink. He bought it. He drink an expensive water. So if he don't got the expensive water, he ain't drinking no water. My gallon. I boil. I boil some water in a minute with a lemon. I get three gallons. Like I know of how to make water. alkaline water. Some lime. How much my water? I boil it. Like three dollars. <laughs> For three of them, it costs a oh, dollar. Three dollars. Yeah. Exactly. Your so water they cost a dollar. I got three gallons though. Yeah, but the water has acidic. That water is not acidic. You don't know. You, you, it's you not. You don't know. Have you tested it? It tastes way better than all the, the, the Deer level? Park and the Sunny. Have you tested the pH level? No, you don't. Let's, so you let's don't do know some shout outs. If it's acidic or not. I thought it was acidic. Acidic. Not acidic. 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 Acid With an A. <laughs> yeah, she don't know how to pronounce it. I don't. I don't care. And if you ever talk about me, you can kiss my black. You know the rest. Because... It is what it is. It is what it is. Like, people don't talk, be talking how they want to talk. I'm going to talk how I want to oh, talk. Oh, they, they, uh, they got Young Dolph. Uh, Killer. Yeah. Yeah. He in custody after a fucking worldwide but, but man. Wait, didn't they find a picture where that boy was right behind him or something? Mm -hmm. Like, he know him and he was like behind him in the picture. Probably. Like, that's crazy when somebody you know kill you yeah. off of hate and jealous. It's a cold world. Super cold. So we're about to get some shout outs to the people that commented on the last video. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all and thank you so much. Um, anybody that comment happy birthday to me, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Big Capricorn vibes. Capricorn, it's the last day to be a Capricorn, so. She barely made it. 
I made it. I made the cut. She was almost so curious. Uh-uh. <laughs> so, Ebony, so what's your my name is? What? That's her name. Ebony, so what's your my name is? Shout out oh, to you. I was about to say, how are you just going to do somebody's name like that? <laughs> no, that's her name. <laughs> Uh, shout out to Star Taylor, shout out to Gloria Johnson, shout out to Destin to be great, and shout out to Elle, y'all. We love y'all. Thank mm-hmm. you for coming on our videos, because I know y'all be watching our videos. And all we the love way down the with the Black Club. Oh, tell them with the comment down below if they watch this video all the way to the end. If you watch this video all the way through, comment down below. Man, you be thinking while you be talking too much. I do. Yes. If you watch this video all the way to the end, comment down below birthday balloons for me, y'all. So I know y'all watch the video all the way to the end. And a or punch emoji. Cake. And a punch emoji for her birthday lady. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. You gonna tell them my age. <laughs> you better chill. Got my birthday lady saying. Okay, y'all. So I'm about to go enjoy the rest of my day. Party. Get some birthday looks. All right, y'all. We're going to end this video right here. Stay tuned for the next video. Episode coming out Friday, y'all, 8 o'clock. Stay tuned.